Good morning. Good morning. Hare Krishna, welcome. Thursday, Thursday, Fours Day, Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, Thurs, Fours Day, Thor Four. November. It's November. Nov Ember? What is Nov Ember? Hmm? Well, first of all, it's a moon. A moon, a month, month, moon. And uh, we are told Nov Ember. November begins with the moon. The moon in November begins here. Just past the halfway mark after Halloween. It's hard holding this up to the camera like this, you know. It's tricky. There we are. Thor's Day, the first of November. We're told November is 11th, the L eventh month. But guess what? Originally, Nope, it was number nine. See, septem in Latin is seven. October, oct, octagon, octogram, octopus, eight. Seven, separation here of autumn. Sun goes into his tomb, falling in fall. Libra Aries from, this is when the sun goes from, in the northern hemisphere from from Virgo at the belly in our anatomy to Libra at the hips, Scorpio in the genitals, October, octopus, November, eighth ember, seventh ember, eighth ember, ninth ember, decem, tenth ember, ten. Originally it was all about the ten, decem, say ten. Saturn, Santa, Satan and Santa of December Deception. So Novum is nine in Latin. This is El Atin. Perfect lead in to talking about L again. Oh what the hell, let's talk about L some more. Why why not, huh? Cause we really uh, don't hear anything about L. Everyone in the world world is mute on L, even though it's the letter 12 phonetic, the Lamed and Lambda, Lamed, Phoenician, Lambda, Greek, and also Hebrew, it's the Lamed of life, number 12 positioned in the alphabetical order, because it's the Phoenician bull god L, the Aleph, the Alpha, the Canaanite god who rises and sets, Aten, S, the sun on the ecliptic making the S, the wave, the secret of creation lies in the wave, said Walter Russell, Russell, Six dances Razzell. from La Danserie by Tilman Susato, that's the Millar Brass Ensemble. It's 9.42, lots of beautiful music for this kind of atmospheric day. 10.03, it's forays heavenly pavan that's a, that's a piece that kind of defies gravity it feels like it's floating the whole time and a little bit later on a symphony by wagner he did write one of course he's known mostly for operas there are some composers like that chopin you think piano and well sibelius maybe or mahler you think symphonies wagner you think opera so it's really nice to hear his symphony in c that's coming up at 11 o'clock. And coming up now, it's Mozart. This is his Eine kleine Nachtmusik, a uh, little night music, the English concert and Andrew Manzi. Jesus says, Matthew chapter 11, verse 29, take my yoke. Right? It's easy. His yoke's easy. He's not saying over easy eggs. He's saying take my yoga, which means yoke. He says, Matthew 6, 22, when your eye be single, when your eye is single, in the mid L, your body is filled with light, with life. You're alive when you see by the pineal gland, 
you're dead when you see by the two eyes, not linked to the pineal gland. It's a yoke just to join your one to your two and unite your two in the process, transcending dualism. So L is the light. Let's look at the word alliteration. To join, to yoke is to join the two oxen, the two alephs, alphas. Christ is Krishna, is Osiris, Ris, Risser, rising, Os Horus on the horizon, Gotama. Gotama is the surname of Buddha. And what is Gotama in etymology, in its origin? Literally, what is it saying? Gotama. Guess what it's saying? Hmm. Yep, it's saying from the highest ox, which is the Alpha Aleph, the ox, the bull, L. The L Lord of light and life. The word alliteration. In the dictionary. L alliteration. Alliteration. A L L I T E R A T I O N. Today's, uh, today's numerology, by the way, 11-1-1-1-1, as we're told it is now originally. They put Janus January as the new one, because Janus Jan of January is the Roman, the Italic, God of Doors, the door of the new year, right? The new God, the new Janus, Jesus, Jupiter, Zeus. Jesus is a Greek name. Where will you spend eternity? Alliteration. Allocution. So, alliteration. Noun. Repetition of the same initial letter or sound in two or more nearby words, as, for example, as foolish fancy, both beginning with F, foolish fancy. Alliteration, repetition, repetition, petition, petter, of the same initial letter, initial letter, or sound in two or more nearby words. Alliteration. Where will you spend eternity? Where will you spend a period of time which never begins and ends? That's what eternity is. That's what this now moment is, because this now is always. It's always now. It's always eternity. So where will you spend eternity? It's where are you spending it, because you're in it. Eternity is not just after you're dead, okay? <laughs> I mean, where does they start? So they're trying to convince you of your their fall, their false doctrine of the fall, and they're trying to tell you that it's scripture that tells you that you should follow their false doctrine and say, I believe, I believe, therefore I'm going to be okay after I die. This is the, how are they convincing you of that? These children? These are children putting this shit out, okay? Make no mistake. And they're blind. They're the blind leading the blind. Dear soul, dear soul, dear soul, let me ask you the most important question of your entire life, which determines where. They got these bold letter words, some are bold. They got important, where. All these other ones are. <laughs> where you will spend, and in bold letters, eternity. The question is, are you saved? Not whether you are religious, but have you been forgiven? Not whether you are religious, but what have you been forgiven, born of God, declared holy, and thus follow Christ. Oh, declared holy. Who's declaring you holy, hmm? If you were to die right now, do you know whether you would be with God in heaven or be suffering in hell with your sins? The Bible, the assured word of God, has the answer to this most important of questions. Most important, underlined. Most important of questions. Ooh, it's the life is coming out. 
My goodness, his saliva of salvation. Saliva is have, has everything to do with salvation. It really does. Because it's that would have the salt in your blood, you know, your biology. Your, if you didn't have saliva, you'd be done. Your saliva saves you. First, you must realize that you are not going to heaven because you are good enough, or for, as it is written, as it is written in quotes now, as it is written, there is none righteous, no, not one. They are all gone out of the way. For all have sinned and come short of the glory of God. Romans chapter 3, verse 10. They just go right into the quotes, the assured word of God. Okay, well, let's examine this now. Because this is what you gotta do to expose this bullshit. These children. Children who don't know how to read the scriptor. Scriptor of Taurus, the bull. Symbolically. Symbolism. L is the Phoenician phonetic for the Phoenician, P H O E N I C I A N. The Phoenician or Canaanite, the Phoenicians are the Canaanites, where present day Palestine and Israel are located. The bull god of Phoenicia, the ancient bull god, is El. L equals letter number 12 of the alphabet. John 1 5, God is light, L light. L light beginning with L, liter alliteration, literature, allegory, light, life, L life. John 1 5 says it right there, God is light. Or photon, pho, same beginning as phonetian, phonetian phonetics, sound. Homophone means same sound, like sun and sun. It's the sun worshipped on sun's day. God's sun. All allegory is literature, which says one thing, and it, as an analogy for something else, for something else, something deeper. It tell it could be a like a parable, right? It's on the surface, it's. A common, it's a common, it's um, profane, worldly, mundane, earthly, lowly, a lowly, a lowly story to talk about something universal and that and deep, having to do with all, everything. So we have the elections of the, the uh, where you elect those selected for you by the Elites who tell you to worship the L Lord of the uh, W Lord, Word and Lord. Which Logos is the Holy Word where we get ologies, studies of. Ology, O L O G Y, Logi, logic, logarithm, logic and rhythm, electricity. Tri city of the matrix of matter, of Plato's cave cavity, cage, case, for the carcass that you carry and you have your career, your incarnation, where if you don't follow the L law, you get an in, you get incarceration, Ray Shan, Ray Sun, God, Light, Life, El Soul. El Shaddai, who creates the shadow, the twelve light that creates the shadow at six, the the light bearer Lucifer Christopher Phosphorus, that is undifferentiated, undivided at the top at twelve, the greater, and then divided below, divine, divide, bellow on the ground level, L-E-V-E-L, -E the light is scattered in the shade, shapes, shadows, shades of, Shad, of Shaddai. Shad is devil in Hebrew, devel, deva, el. Okay? 
God and Satan, 12 and 6, Jesus, Ju Jupiter, Saturn, Jesus, Satan.